Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a massive, massive sticker planner haul, whatever you want to call it. This is going to be a long one. This is probably going to be a talkative one. Um, so I hope you guys are ready and into that and excited for it. If you're not, definitely there's other videos that you can check out on my channel that might be up your alley. But if you're excited to see some stickers and various washies and all this random stuff that I have, um, definitely stay tuned because there's a lot of good, good stuff in this. So let me move all of this aside. This is probably going to have to be shot in like sections because um, one, there's so much and my camera will probably overheat at some point in time. And um, it is Sunday right now and I think I might get some packages on Monday. So I don't want them to like sit for two weeks until I get a chance to haul them. So let's start out with the scribble print stuff that i have i have four things from scribble prints co um, because i've been obsessed with her stuff and her releases um but two of them are like wiggle it wednesdays and then i have my um monthly and then i have some of her like accessory type stuff um that she came out with so i'm going to move all of this to the side all of the mailers and let's jump into it with the wiggle it wednesdays so i have two here and i think i have two on the way or one on the way something like that and it's because she's been doing some really um nice neutral type stuff she did a hollow and a silver which i have here and then i also ordered her hot gold and if she does a regular gold i'll probably pick that up because those are t really the only two foil type thing or four hollow not hollow foil type things that i do there we go that was hard to, it's hard to say okay so she did do these like disney journaling cards which i think are so cute she has her little scribblers dressed up as tiana and cinderella so i'm definitely gonna hang on to those um and then Let's get the like freebies out of the way. So one time I used Andrea's code, which got me the little munchkin sampler there, which is really cute. And then um, the other time I used Jessica's code, so I got her sampler and then this really pretty um, foiled bow sticker as well. So um, also really cute and really funny. Um, Emily from Scribble Prince Co. was watching one of my videos while she was packaging it. So she sent me that really cute note. So if you're watching Emily, thank you so much. I love, Little notes like that, um, it makes like a uh, order more personalized, if that makes any sense. Um, so the first one that I ordered here was her matte silver, which this is so pretty, so unique, but at the same time, I feel like you could mix it with other silvers, um, but it's really pretty. And um, I ordered four of her sets of them, um, and they're two dollars a piece I think and then these are all f the these are freebie sheets um so yeah and then you get to use a coupon all that good stuff so one set comes with this sheet here which has the script on it you get family time plan next week new releases cuddle time Netflix and chill payday and then this full box overlay that says stay focused and extra sparkly now all of the freebies say that um, which is kind of a bummer because I feel like I'm not going to use this quote over and over and over again, but I can definitely just snip that off and put it in my stash pile because, you know, not everyone can get their hands on overlays and I feel like that would be fun. So that's what those say for those. And then four of these icon sheets, which I love these um, because they're so versatile. So I'm excited to have those. And then four of these sheets would ha which have these circle icons and then the date um, squares, which I'm really excited about the date squares, uh, to have like transparent date squares to use. And then four of the full box overlays here and they're just the ones with the tiny bit of sparkles on the corners and top and bottom. So I like how dainty those are. Um, and then I'm just going to go into depth on one and then we'll speed through the other one. And then I also got four of the, um, header overlays, which are just like fine sparkles. And then four of these, which also have little scripts at the bottom and these say plan next week, payday, happy meal, me time, new releases, coffee run. You get some of her bows in a bigger size and a smaller size. You get some, um, corner 
overlays and then a bow, a star, a TV, a coffee cup, and a birthday present bigger icon. So I'm excited about those and since I got four of them I do have two um, sets of each of the overlays which is nice to add into spreads and stuff like that when I want to use this color. So that is the um, matte silver that I got and then same same idea with the hollow sparkle that she did um so we got the freebies there um for those the little icons just so you guys can see what the glitter looks like um the circle icons and date dots i love hollow it's so pretty the headers and then the overlays this is gonna be so pretty with like a snow kit or something like that um, and then the kind of like quarter and bow sheets there. So that is my Wiggle It Wednesday. And like I said, I have a gold one coming. So yeah. Um, and then I also ordered her candy cane washi, which I'm very excited about because I don't have any other Scribble Prince Co. washi. So at least I don't think I do. No, I don't. So one is just the bows with the candy cane print inside of them. Let me open this so that you guys can see it. And it does have, this is so dangerous, don't do this at home, please. But I continue to do it. You know, I like to make things exciting. Okay, so <laughs> there's this, and it does have a white background with the candy cane bones, bones, bows. And this is where it opens. And I really like her bows because they're so different, but oh, they're so cute. That's going to be fun with like a... Christmas spread or in my Kiki K for my setup because I did order her TN kit as well for um, my Christmas setup so that I don't have to brave Hobby Lobby again to find papers and whatnot. And then this one is foiled, but the candy cane print is across the background and the bows are silver foiled. So that's another really pretty option as well. And they were a set. So there's that. And then I ordered this at the same time as the washies. So I got the journaling card here, which is really pretty. Um, it's silver foiled. And then I ordered her bow air freshener because I'm using the one that she sent in her July mystery kit, which was like the fall one. So I wanted this mint one for the holiday season. And then another bow freebie. And then I ordered two sheets of her birthday Um like foiled sheets, I got the gold and the silver. And so it does have a birthday countdown and then it has various different sayings um, that have to do with birthdays and stuff like that that you could use for your own birthday or someone else's birthday. So I thought that was lots of fun. And then shield your eyes if you don't wanna see a full walkthrough of the mystery kit, but this is it and it's a planner girl kit. And I'm definitely gonna save this for February um, just because the color scheme reminds me of February. <laughs> um, but you get a ton of extras, so you get the uh, notepad here with the Ikea cart on the side. You get this temporary tattoo bow, which is really pretty. With in, It's in gold. Um, and then you have the munchkin sampler there. And then you have the bows that match the kit and the girl boxes in various different girls. Her face looks really long. <laughs> That's the first thing I noticed is that her face looks really long, but I think the backgrounds all, of all of these are really pretty, especially for like a pink kit. I'm impressed. Um, and then the foil freebie this month was um, a bunch of various like scripts in gold foil. Um, so you have plan next week, payday, happy mail. You get six of each of those. You get four me times, two new, re new releases, and two coffee run scripts. So that's super nice. And then you have your journaling card as well in the gold foil. And then quickly going through the kit because you guys know the scribble prints format. You have your full boxes, deco, work labels, all that jazz. You have your extra full box here, which I love this full box. And then all of your icons and some boxes or some boxes. Yeah. Habit trackers, all the functional stuff, sidebar stuff. I really love the marble. You have your half boxes and other boxes page. Uh, washi, pattern washi, labels, and headers, little things, plain washi, and labels, your heart check boxes, 
your bottom washi date cover-ups and then these are still in washi strips but she talked about how she's changing that in the coming uh, subscription boxes and then also you get the glitter sampler as well so like I said probably won't see me use this until February um, just because the colors really m remind me of that and I think it would be a fun transition in between February and March maybe because I already have a transition between January and February which is going to be um what is it called it was one of the other mystery kits I believe it was it was like the brunch one and I had a bunch of different like girl boxes in it and stuff like that so yeah that is the Scribble Prince Co mystery kit and then we have a caress press order here and I got a ton of her mini kits and um, she was doing like a freebie thing um, so I got one of her um, what's it what are these called sticky note pads <laughs> and um, it has the Disney castle in the background which is so pretty so definitely going to use that um, but these are the three different personal sorry not mini she does have a mini kit uh, but these are her new personal kits so I'm gonna go in depth for one and then um, the other two will just show you what it looks like so this one is her hollow new year kit and so you get uh, three pages and it's kind of like a glam planner kit um, where it has like the icons some deco you have your little circle icons flags payday flag three heart check flags um some habit trackers bill do labels labels and quarter boxes um and then you have your washi for the side of inserts and these two actually line up to make a picture um and then you have um six full boxes on this page which are so pretty and then your weekend banner at the bottom and then you have a seventh full box here with a weekly ombre you have some glitter labels and glitter headers here you end up with eight glitter headers and then you have some little things and sidebar um, headers as well so I think it's kind of like the perfect kit for if you have a personal planner um, and for me like this will be used when I'm not in school so I can always pull in like other icons and stuff like that if I wanted to um, but there's not a whole lot of space so you don't need a whole lot of like boxes and whatnot so there's that and then quickly going through these others this one I think I'm going to use for my birthday week it's her starry-eyed one so you have your front page your full boxes this was like the fashion um, neutral clip art that just came out and then you have this one here which is so pretty I love the neutral colors I'm so excited <laughs> um, but yeah so my birthday's in December so I kind of like doing a darker neutral kit but that's also just like me um, I feel like any time I would do that for my birthday so I think that's really nice and then this one is super cute um, I want to save this for February but I might have to use it beforehand because I'm kind of short on like personal size kits this was my uh, freebie for ordering which these stickers are really really pretty um, but you have your front page here and this was her um, woodland tales kit and she has all these still up in her shop too um, and look at the little animals oh they're so sweet and then you have like a storybook down there and then the little chipmunk and the side washi has books in it too which is just perfect I love that yeah I really love that kit so that is my order from Crest Press and I really think that I'm going to get her monthly kit for January um, when she comes out with it um, with her deco sidebar because I'm excited that she started doing that um, option for kits then we have my glam planner mystery kit and it's uh, Victoria's Secret fashion show themed which I think is awesome because I don't really see myself buying a fashion show kit for that week but if I have it I'll totally use it because I watch it um, but you get a double box which has like the Victoria's Secret showroom type scene which is really pretty and this is the same format you have the bras here which are really pretty um, and then like the tickets she now has glitter headers I don't know if I had that in the last one that I showed you guys but those are there 
and um, you have your deco and your other boxes which are really really pretty and she always puts in like various skin tones for her deco stickers which I think is really considerate for all the different skin tones that there are um, so yeah that's the mystery kit um, and that is the last week of November first week of December type um, week that's going on so I'm gonna use that then and then this here is I think the last PVC sale order that I was waiting on and this is from Little Miss Papery and she like threw in a bunch of extras I think because we had to wait so long um, so I'll get to the extras after I show you what I actually purchased so this is what I purchased and she gave me the $25 PVC sale uh, freebie I don't know if I actually spent $25 but if I did here it is <laughs> um, and it's really pretty and it matches the card that you got um, for ordering um, which is really nice and then let's see here so I ordered her foiled um, date numbers or whatever and I don't know if I ordered two gold on accident but I got two of the gold and they come in diff in three different um, fonts and then one of the silver here um, again same fonts but just different foil um, and then I did get more of her work labels because I've been using them so much. She doesn't have her school ones anymore, or at least they didn't when I ordered. But it does look like she has a like different colors, more colors, which is nice. Um, and then there's this notepad here that says the best time for new beginnings is now, which is great for the new year. Um, and then these are all the like freebies that she threw in. I think they're misfits, um, but we'll see. So there's a freebie of some sort there's this little um like deco sheet with the koala on it there's some glitter headers which i'm definitely going to hang on to um one is matte and one is um not <laughs> it's um glossy there we go and then there's these headers again one glossy one not and um some little things none of these are from like the same like kit um, and then there's a box of I mean a sheet of like heart checklists and then the sheet here with various boxes and whatnot there's this with like smaller um, what are these called full boxes um, which I'll probably hang on to this and do like a fun personal spread with um, in the summer and I think this matches but this is like the workout sheet I think that goes with this kit um oh no this is destination I don't know but this is in matte this is in glossy so I'll probably put that in the desatch pile well and then she has this like bottom washi sheet from another one that is glossy and then this may sheet from like a monthly so I think these sheets here I'm gonna put in my desatch pile because I don't have a purpose for them but I know that um, when I do my D-Stash giveaway, whoever gets them will definitely have a purpose for them. So I'm going to put these back in this cello bag and put it in the D-Stash, the D-Stash pile. But it was very nice of her to, like, include that as a, like, a sorry for it taking so long. Um, I always appreciate shops that do stuff like that. Because it lets you know that they're still thinking about you. Um, and then I got this order from Paper and Milk. And I was very excited about this order. It's my first order from her, and the stickers are so beautiful. Um, and she even wrote my name on it, which is awesome. So there's this fall um, holograph or like glittery, yeah, holographic um, pumpkin spice latte. What is the name? Maru, right? That's what they're called, Maru. Um, little like die cut type thing and then there's two of these the be patient with yourself type thing I'll probably put this in my Kiki K now because it kind of matches both of those match my setup and then there's this PVC sale freebie and it's so cute that she puts like um like it's a nutrition facts which is really nice and then last freebie there was this fall weather um, card which is really cute and then these are the things that I ordered. So I ordered the Sleep Time Marus in the various different colored blankets. And then I got the Binge Watch script, the different emojis um, Marus. This is part two. And then I got the travel one, which I'm so excited about because I just found out I'm going somewhere in January. So these will be helpful for like packing and stuff like that. And then I got the latte and hot chocolate sheet. 
the game night sheet, which I think is so cute, especially the stack of little games, sleep in script, YouTube Marus, um, the little like working laptop work. Um, like the little marshmallow looks so happy. <laughs> and then the work script as well. I really liked her script options. So those are those. And then I have a Shop Jessica Hearts order here, which is December monthly stuff. And then there's another one of these fall cards, which I'll probably, I think I'll put in my D stash because journaling cards are fun. Um, so I got these two here, which are the same. They are her pine collection. She had um, three different photo collections, I think, for December, but this one I thought was really pretty. So you get your top bar, your date dots, and your payday flags. This is the other bar with um, a space to cover up the days that aren't in the month. All the holidays and some labels. You have your sidebar, um, headers for that, icons, more labels, build due, flags, strips to cover, or like to mark off spans of time, full boxes, and cancel change of plans, and rescheduled stickers. Um, and I got it in matte, and as you can tell, like, the print quality is still beautiful. Sometimes with darker kits, when you print them on matte paper, you lose a, bit, a little bit of that rich color, but not with her kits. Her kits are stunning, either way. Um, and then I did get the notes page kit, um, which is the same as all the other ones. Um, you have your top bar, bottom bar, and your circles, and then your two kind of bars for the middle of the notes page. So... That is that from Shop Jessica Hearts. I really love her notes page kits. I'm really tempted to say that they're my favorite just because they're so simple and it's easy to add what you need to. Um, and then my second favorite is probably Planning Roses. Those I'm like very, very sure of. So this is from, oh yes, Whimsical Cats. Whimsical Cat Studio. Hold on, I think my... Um, yeah, there we go. Okay, so we're gonna put this aside and this aside. Um, so it came in this little like cardstock envelope that says Witch Please, which is super cute. Her packaging and like her marketing and everything is just so cute. Like, look at this. Oh, so pretty. Um, okay, so then I got sent this little like elf die cut, which is perfect. I'm gonna save that for my setup for December. And then I got these two little freebies here. Um, which I'm very pleased with and then these are the stickers that I ordered um, so I got the filming editing and uploading stickers and you have a ton of different options to pick from for her different characters um, I got her you can do it stickers for like doing a bunch of homework um, I got the payday stickers because I'm running low on payday stickers so I ordered a bunch of them from various shops. I got these for me and my friend because I thought they were so cute. Um, they are like her couple stickers but I just thought they were cute and they have a bunch of like little hearts. I think Jessica did, the, did this with Andrea um, but yeah so there's that. Same with these um, just because they're so much fun and like I don't know, her little drawings, like, that's totally me in an oversized blue sweatshirt. <laughs> um, and then I got the countdowns to... What is that holiday? New Year. <laughs> Why was that so hard? Um, but yeah, I'm excited to use those. And then I got this sheet here, mostly because I wanted to use the It sticker for marking, finishing, rating it. Um, so perfect timing, but I also have these for next year. They're her like doodled Halloween stickers. And then lastly, her taco stickers because they're so cute. I couldn't pass them up. So there are all of those. And next we have Firefly Paper Shop, which I saw these kits on her Instagram and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to order. Um, so I got her mini kit format. So I'm just going to show you one like in depth and then we'll just flip through the other one. I did get the glitter headers for all of them because they are pretty unique colors. Um, so this is the glitter headers for this one and this is the Give Thanks kit. And oh my gosh, look at the puppy. <laughs> I really got this kit just for that full box, but everything else is so beautiful. I would say that she's like the queen of photo kits because all the photo kits I've ever seen from her are just gorgeous and they're on glossy paper. Oh, so beautiful. So there's that. And then we have the boxes page with some little things, half, I mean, habit trackers, flight tracker, and a bill due. 
And then we have some washies, these check flags, a sidebar box, a check box, and some headers, which this is a really nice format for like a mini kit, because I could totally use this in my main planner as well. Um, and then we have the bottom washi, some more icons, some deco pieces, weekend, movie marquee, and flags for the corner. So that is the Give Thanks kit. Again, so pretty. I love it so much. Um, and then I got her Merry and Bright kit, which I might use this in um, January, um, just because, you know, Christmas kits are hard. But it says Merry Christmas, so I think I have to use it in December. Um, but yeah, the little moose. <laughs> All the animals get me. Um, and these are the glitter hunters. Um, but yeah. I really love these colors too. I think that's the other thing. I just feel like everything that she does is so well put together. Um, like you can tell the attention to detail is there. And it, I haven't seen a lot of shops use this like photo clip art. So yeah, that's the Marion Bright one. And then this is going to be my um, New Year's kit. I know for sure, I think in... <laughs> I know for sure, I think, um, in my main planner, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, I did get this foiled freebie. Um, and then, again, the glitter headers. And we have just beautiful, I love these balloons, the sparkly balloons. Um, and then very simple colors. I love blue and silver. It's like one of my favorite combos. Um, so yeah, that is Firefly Paper Shop. She is a little bit more on the pricey side, I will say that, but you're paying for like the uniqueness of a photo kit. Um, but like the mini kits are a much cheaper option than her full size kit and you could definitely get away with doing like a no white space spread with those. Okie doke, next I have this order from Rose Colored Days, which I think no, this is not my first order from Rose Color Days, but it's one of the first in a while. Um, and I got this Bloom journaling card here, which is so pretty. Save that for spring. And then there's these um, freebies that I got. These are like pinkish red um, headers, and this is a gold sampler. And then, so I got a lot. <laughs> I got her Hello Month, and then it also comes with Spring, Summer, Fall, and Winter, um, which I'm excited for those. One in silver and one in gold. And then I got her Happy Meal script. Um, I think I just got one in silver. Is that right? I guess. <laughs> I think that's right. Um, so yeah, I got that. And then I got these, which are her frame overlays. So you get six in like one set there. So you get like 20 of the little ones. And then you get one, two, three, four. Um, so you get 16 different size frames in each, which I think that's a really good deal. Um, so I got one in gold and one in silver. And then I got some of her header overlays, her like confetti ones in silver and gold. Um, and then these are her just general countdowns for a month. So I'm actually gonna use one of these for a countdown to the vacation I'm going on. But again, one in silver, one in gold. And then I got um, birthday countdowns. Um, and I accidentally got two in silver, oopsies. Um, but two in silver and one in gold. And I'm gonna have to break into this gold one here for next week because it's four weeks until my birthday, but I only have the silver one right now. So I'm gonna need to do that. And then I got some overlays here, one in silver, one in gold. And these are just like the little dots and stars at the top of the box. And then I got her confetti ones, silver and gold as well. And then I got her heart ones for Valentine's Day time. I thought these were really cute. There's some at the bottom and some at the top. Again, gold and silver. So that's rose colored days. And then, hold on, I'm gonna stop and start my camera again. Okie doke. And then lastly, I have this order from the Sticky Committee. Now, I'm kind of bummed about this because it took a long time for this to get to me. And then 
once it like said it shipped, it took a long time to start shipping again. I have another order from her that says that it shipped a while ago and it still hasn't updated the tracking, which I'm kind of concerned about. I know she's on some sort of like trip or like honeymoon, honeymoon or something like that, but I sent her an email about this order and I'm thinking about emailing her again because I haven't gotten a response in like a week and a half, I think it is, but I'm missing five things from this order and I love, love, love her stickers and her quality of overlays and stuff like that. Like, her paper is awesome and everything. I'm just, like, bummed that there's kind of... I mean, I'm sure that there's a lot going on for her and, like, her schedule and everything. But, yeah, these are the things that I'm missing. I'm missing some dot headers in gold. I'm missing a... Uh, the clear full box confetti overlay in silver and gold. And the clear snow bottom washi in silver and go gold. So... I'll give you an update on that as we get closer to it, but I'm kind of bummed right now. Hopefully she emails me back soon and we get that fixed. But this is what I did receive from my order. I got her star overlays, her headers, and I got... This was a mistake too. I got two of these in gold and then one in silver. I was only supposed to get one. But I do appreciate that. I don't know if that was on purpose or not. Um, and then I got her dot overlays. This is one that I'm missing. I'm missing it in gold, but this is the one in silver. And then I got these snow full box overlays, one in silver, one in gold. And then these are the bottom washi ones that I got. I got these star bottom washi overlays. This is her like pre-cut one. So you get two like strips of it, which is nice because you could do two spreads with it. Again, one in silver, one in gold. And I got the, her abstract lines bottom washi, one in silver, one in gold, to match the full box overlays that I have like this already. And then we have the dots bottom washi, one in silver, one in gold. The hearts in gold, I already have one in silver, so I just got the one in gold. And then these are some of her snowflakes. The other one that I'm missing has bigger or no, smaller, like, snow-looking, but these are, like, the full-blown uh, snowflake ones, one in silver, one in gold, so I'm excited to get to use those, and I hope I get the other stuff soon, because I'm anxiously awaiting those, because I really want to use, I really want to use her stuff more. Um, okay, so the next thing here is from Scribble Prince Co., um, but this is her advent album. Now, I'm not gonna open it, but I wanted to show you what it came in and stuff like that, and kind of ask you guys, I believe I have four advent albums or like advent calendars of some kind would you guys want me to put the stuff that I open into the haul that I'm gonna put up do you not want me to show you anything at all do you want me to put them in my other videos um leave me a comment down below how you guys want to go about that because I definitely can't open them each day with you guys and I don't want to put them in like some of them are 12 day ones like I don't want to mess up a surprise for anyone so Leave me comments down below telling me how you think I should go about that type of thing. Um, but this is one of them, and I just wanted to show you guys the outside of it. I haven't even opened it. I'm not going to spoil the surprise. All of my advent albums or advent calendars that I get, I'm going to open on the appropriate days and stuff like that. But this is the album. It's really cute. Um, let me show you in comparison to my Erin Condren the size that it is. So... It's a decent size um, album, and then the little, like, Tis the Season with the two different bows is really, really cute. And then um, I did open it to see, like, I didn't open any of the pouches, but I wanted to see if it was just, like, numbered and whatnot. And there are different journaling cards on the front of each page. I won't show you just in case anyone wants to keep that a secret. Um, but it is super duper thick. It's almost as thick as my Erin Condor planner is right now. And I guess the premise, if you didn't know, is that it has all four seasons in it of like different stickers and different stuff like that so I'm very excited about this one and it was kind of a fluke that I got my hands on this because I didn't jump on it right away when it was released I kind of waited a few days and then I saw that it was still up and I was like you know I'll splurge on it because it's something that I think once I saw people opening it I would have been bummed that I didn't get my hands on it so she still had some left and so I purchase one for myself but definitely leave me those comments down below about how you want me to go about my advent stuff if you guys like just don't care or if there's like a way that you can think of that I should go about opening each one all right guys I have two more packages here the first one is from Wontana and a million and I'm so happy that this came today um it's currently Monday right now because I ordered some of her voting stickers and 
voting is tomorrow, so <laughs> I'm glad that I got them. But the order comes in this like menu, which I think is so handy. And I'm totally gonna keep this on my desk, I think, or one of the cards that come in here because it has all their names on it. So I'm gonna try and like not totally mess up their names anymore. <laughs> um, but yeah, so there's the menu, which is really cute. I still need to try dim sum. And she also has um, like a little post-it note in there that she hand wrote, which is really cute. I think I'll actually save that because that's fun. Um, so there's that. And then I ordered some different stuff here. So let's open this up. She has since changed her paper since the last time that I ordered from her. Um, and it's really nice. It's almost, I think it is a vinyl or a type of vinyl. She calls it like a unicorn glossy vinyl, um, which I think is really cute. But let me move all this. I'm going to save this one on my desk and we'll just throw this other one away. Um, but she also has foiled stickers now, which is super exciting. So let's jump into this. Let's, I guess, go, we'll save the foiled ones last because those are really pretty. Um... So this is the little freebie that came with my order. I'm gonna zoom you guys in a little bit. And this is what's to come. She's gonna have holiday and winter washi, a very hago Christmas, countdown to 2019, and fantastic bows and where to eat them. That's really cute. Take on fantastic beasts and where to find them. And then she sent out this I Voted sticker, which is so pretty. I don't think I have it in me to wear this because it's so pretty. I'm going to find a place to put it in my planner as like a memory keeping type thing. Um, so that was another little freebie that she had. And then these were the non-foiled items that I picked up. I picked up her Mo Money Mo Dumplings, um, which is like her payday stickers and Two of them are like the Monopoly <laughs> guys, and then you have the ones with the all the different types of money ones. And then I got this one, but first coffee, because I've actually noticed that I have very few coffee stickers, and some of them like don't match all of my spreads, so I need some more coffee stickers, and these are all very neutral, so, and I thought they were cute. There's various ones. There's like happy ones, and then like I need coffee. And then I also got the planner nerd ones. These are more geared towards, well, like these I could use for school with the glasses, um, but then these, like the pen and the planners, um, I could use for setting up a Kiki K. And then I got the do it for the sticker, um, which I think is so funny because I do love stickers. Um, but they're the voting ones and I'm actually gonna go in and put some of these into my main planner for this week and in the monthly view and stuff like that, so. Um, and then I also got the nachos talk and tacos and burritos. And you even have some with margaritas, which is really cute. Um, but you get two of them that have burritos, which I think is really nice for um, going to Chipotle. But then you also have other Mexican food options for if I go to a restaurant. And then I got the Let's Go to the Movies, which is really, really cute. I love the crying ones. There's actually a movie coming out that's called Five Feet Apart. If you guys haven't seen that trailer, please go watch it. Cole Sprouse is in it, and um, it's coming out in March, which I know, a long time ahead. But it's like, it reminded me of The Fault in Our Stars, and I was crying watching the trailer, and I was like, I need to see this movie. <laughs> okay, and then next are the foiled ones. So this is her winter Bunderland, I think. Um, she has a lot of play on words, but it's silver foiled, and as you can see, all of them have different, like, foiled aspects. I think this one is my favorite. The little hot chocolate is foiled. Um, but yeah, and then you have this big scene one that could be, I feel like it could be a weekend banner if you trim the edges a little bit, but that's super cute. And then we have the winter bucket list here, which has some really cute stuff, like go ice skating. I really like the snuggle one forgot to shave. She has a whole sheet of these, um, if you guys need that reminder. Um, and then just a lot of other fun stuff. And then these are actually separate. The, like, um, title is separate than the sticker, so if you don't want to use the, like, bucket list title, you can just use the characters, um, which is fun if you want to use them for, like, deco purposes. And then these are gold foiled, and this is her, um, Christmas bundle, I believe it is. So this one is, it's the most wonderful time of year. And you have all the different like 
Christmas activities and then this is another big banner type sticker and then this one is all hot cocoa and cookie themed and then you have candy canes and snowflakes too which are totally foiled which I love again these are probably better for like deco purposes but so pretty and then a Christmas bucket list, which same premise, it has like them separated, but all the different activities. Again, I really love this one. This one says drinking eggnog and one has like the swirly eyes. <laughs> um, wait up for Santa, which is really cute. That's totally my niece. Um, but yeah, and then we actually found out that we're having Christmas Eve at my house. So this will be fun for like decorating and whatnot. And then lastly, there's a Christmas countdown, which I... I'm so excited about so the little numbers are foiled and then some of the ornaments are foiled and then all of her different characters are in there and I think it's so cute so that is what I got from Wonton in a Million I definitely suggest purchasing from her because she has beautiful paper and now she has beautiful foiled stickers um, and then next I have this massive massive envelope here let me let me zoom out for you guys, um, but I purchased a TN kit from her for the first time, and I'm so excited. I also have her New Year's kit in here, which I'll go over real fast, and I did purchase, like, the Fashion Girl add-on for this kit, um, which I couldn't help. It was, it was so pretty. Like, they're so pretty. I love this. I love these boxes, um, and then two of the little, like, freebies came with it because I used Andrea's coupon code. Um, so there's that, and then these go with this, obviously, but then I got another one of these journaling cards, so we'll just move that to the side, and I did get the mini kit. I'm going to use this in my rewind planner for New Year's, um, but I'm still super duper excited about it, and I think I'm going to use my, um, like, real glitter gold headers from her. This is the kit freebie. And then we have the pages here. So we have the full boxes, the like functional page with all of your deco. The bow on this one is really pretty with the little firecrackers. We have your super functional page. I love the colors. Um, I love anything super neutral with like a tiny pop of color and I'm not super mad that it's hot pink, but that's fine. Um, and then you have your little things, your sidebar headers and all your boxes and then your bottom washi date cover ups. And then this is an extra full box too. So I have tons of full boxes for this kit. I'm so excited about it. Um, I was going to say I have another new year's kit from her, but I don't think I do. I have a caress press one and I have a... Um, what's it called? A Firefly Paper Shop one, which should be in this haul that you guys are watching right now. Um, but yeah, so that's one of the, one of my New Year's kits. And then this is the TN kit, which I've never had one of these before. I believe they vary, like, between each TN kit, but there is a ton in this one, and I have to say it wasn't as expensive as I was expecting it to be for as much as you get. Um, and you could use a coupon code on it, which I know a lot of shops, they don't give that option when they do, like, kits like this and stuff. So, you get your papers in here, and then this is, like, a massive bow die cut, which I totally love. They're so pretty. Um, and then, let's see here. Whoa, what is happening? There's a lot in here. This is exciting. Okay, so these are her regular paper, I believe, and they are glossy. Um, so, you get this first one. Let me move everything. So, you get this first one, which is just the white with red bows, and then the back side is like the abstract um, strokes, and you get two of those, and then you get this one, which is like the strands of bows on a plaid or checkered background, and then the back is like a tan bow pattern, which I think is really pretty. Um, it's like a true tan. I think my camera is kind of making it look lighter than it is, but again, two of those, and then you get this gray and white bow pattern. I don't know if you guys can see, um, which I really love the simplistic ones. And then you get this really pretty one, which is like a really rich dark red um, with gold stars. So I'm very excited about those. This is really nice paper. Like it's thick. It doesn't bend easily, which is nice, especially if you're going to do like a TN setup so that it doesn't get all creased and crinkly. And then in here, I believe we have our acetate or vellum or both. I don't know if both come in this, but let's see here. 
Oh, I think you do get both. So you get an acetate with just the silver bows, and then the back is gold. I love when shops do that. I love having options. <laughs> so there are those. And then this one looks really pretty. I'm trying to see what it says. This you can't do in silver, which is kind of sad, but on this side it is gold, and it says don't get your tinsel in a tangle, which is really cute. And then you get two vellums here. You have one with this beautiful Christmas tree. I believe it goes this way, which that's so stunning. And then you have this one, which is like a sweater pattern, which is also really, really pretty. Um, so yeah, those are the papers. I'm just going to leave those over here with the die cut. And then you get this really cute pouch of all the other goodies so i'm gonna save this like wrap a present in because this is really pretty um okay so these are all, like the extra fun things um so this i'm super excited about it's a planner clip and it is just a gold bow on a gold paper clip and it is so pretty this reminds me of like really fancy big christmas dresses i don't know why <laughs> Um, and then we have this little sticky bow. This will like actually stick onto something which is nice, but it's red I really love this deep red color and then we have this pen which is super pretty you have the red almost burg whoa, almost burgundy barrel and Then it's one of the twisty pens and you have the gold glitter in here and then you have this really cute little paper clip, a bow paper clip. I love clips like this where they're like wire, but they're twisted into a shape. And we have this little, this is like a really pretty charm, but it's a snowflake and it's gold with little um, white crystals in there. And then you do get a roll of her washi, which I think... I think it's the one with the stars. It's the pattern with the stars on it. I'm not too sure. Let me open this. It is gold foiled. I can't tell because it's a really dark color. So that's why I'm going to unroll it for you guys. But let's see. It is foiled. I think I just said that, but yeah, it's gold foiled. Oh, and it is. It's that really pretty paper with like the plaid background with the gold stars, which... I'm all for that. Now I have three rolls of Scribble Prince Co. Washi, which is exciting. Um, I don't think I'll ever get as big of a collection as like my Simply Gilded Washi with Scribble Prince Co. Washi, just because I feel like I don't like the really busy patterns. I don't mind it when I get, in, get them in like subscription boxes, but I like the bow patterns with like just a solid color or like the really simple patterns, but this is gonna be perfect for setting up my Kiki K or my TN. Oh my gosh, there's so much in here. I'm like so surprised by this. Okay, so then there's also the die cuts and I didn't watch the unboxing of this cause she did like an unboxing before she released this and I didn't watch it. So all this stuff is new. So it has a little card there and then you get your gingerbread house, a wreath, some presents, a pillow and Mr. Gingerbread Man. Coco, this really pretty bow, a stocking, a candy cane, and the beautiful tree. So those are really nice. And these are glossy as well. Super thick, high quality. I feel like that's standard for Scribble Prince Co. And I think the bows just didn't get put in here because they were so big. Um, but I'm glad she did that like bow stack because that's really pretty. Okay, and then there's two more packages here. What is it? I don't... I don't understand. Wait, I'm confused. Okay, so in this one, it looks like we get the sticker seals in gold foil, and then this really pretty journaling card with just a white bow on a red background with gold foiling. And then in this one, I wonder if I was meant to get that. In this one, we have another sheet of the bows and then another journaling card. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of journaling cards. So you have this one, the white one. I really like the white one. Oh, the girl. Oh, and you have um, two with different color skin tones on the two sides. And then you have Candy Cane Wishes, Mistletoe Kisses, and Tis the Season to be Jolly. So you get two of those, um, which is nice if you wanted to use them in the same setup and just flip them over. 
That's lots of fun. I like that. I don't know why I got two seals though. Like I'm not complaining. I just, that's fun. And then you do get these little divider tabs um, in all the different patterns and they are um, patterned on both sides. And then you get this um, sheet of transparent um, foil stickers with different headers for the tabs to use, which is a really nice addition. And they're like the really dainty script. So that is my Scribble Prince Tien order. All right, my camera finally overheated, but let's do these last two boxes here for um, at least this clip. If I get anything on Monday, I'll probably do another clip to include those. Um, but for right now, this is it. Um, we have the two subscription boxes from Simply Gilded, and it was because this one here, her Rockstars one, it had a pen gems in it that took forever to get to her, so it kind of took a long time to get to the subscribers. Um, but I love what's in this so much that I was okay with the wait. Um, but let's get everything out of the box. The box is so pretty and I wish I had a way to store these, but I don't, so I have to get rid of them. But it's all holographic foil. Um, so this is what comes in the monthly kit. Let me read off of the, like, card here. <laughs> um, so we have the foil journaling card that says Dare to be Dazzling, um, which is really, really pretty. Um, and then we have the five washi tapes, which are in these, or in this beautiful, like, star pouch. I'll show it better to you after I take everything out. Um, so here are the washi tapes. Um, I won't try and like fiddle with taking them out yet, but they are a version of her Galaxy Washi, which I'm so excited to finally have my hands on. I don't have full rolls of any of her, or well, no, I have a full roll of her, um, of this one, um, but I don't think I have a full roll of anything else of her like galaxy washi, but I finally have a constellation washi and um, the moon washi, which I'm so excited that this is like, oh my goodness, this is the white and the blue um, with the holographic moons. And then this is a bow washi, um, which has like a dark purple, a pink, and then kind of purple again, ombre looking one. And then this is the same as this one, only it's holographic foil and it's a little bit lighter blue. Um, and then there's another small washi here, and this has words on it. It says, like, reach for the stars, rock on, star power, um, stardust, all that other stuff. So I really love these washies. I'm so excited about them. Um, next we have the foiled TN inserts, or insert here, um, which is the same pattern as the... Um, journaling card and has those really pretty foiled lines and this one is blank on the inside and then we have the glitter crystal magnet which is what this is and I put these on my studio lights because they're the only magnetic <laughs> surface that I have in my room um, but it is so pretty I love these colors so yeah I'm going to put that there um, and then we have the Oh, the pouch is what it lists next, but yeah, now that everything's out of it, you can see that the sequins like shake around and it's so pretty. I'm gonna keep my planner clips in this. I keep all my planner clips in like various pouches, so I'm gonna move some of them into this one. And then we have the Pen Gems pen, which I've never owned a Pen Gems pen before. I've heard that they're magical, and that's why everyone wants them. <laughs> but th I think this one was really, really pretty. Um, I'm definitely into washies and like washi and stickers and like planners and stuff like that. I'm not into the pen aspect so much. I've tried to get into it, and I just I can't. I have my Pilot G2s, and I'm sticking to them. But if I get pens and like um, mystery kits and stuff like that, I I use them. Um, but let's see, do I have anything? I'll write on the um, post-it note, which is one of the next things, which these are so pretty. Look how foily they are. Um, but this is what it writes like. It's just a black like ballpoint pen. Um, but yeah, it's really pretty and it's like a purpley color with um, various different colored gems in it. So that's that. And then the post-it notes. And then we have these sticker seals, which are really pretty. I'm gonna have to do another star, um, t or not TN, 
Kiki K setup now because I have these. <laughs> and then we also got the Lux sticker sheets here, which I'll have to save these for April and do a spread in my school planner for. Uh, but you get the two sheets with all of the hollow foil. Um, you have like date cover ups, headers, flags, little tiny um, words. Um, words with like little icons, check boxes, deco, more headers, flags, and then these are full boxes down here. I really love the constellation one. So that is the Lux sticker sheet, and we'll put that back in there. And then that it was it for the September box. That's what this was was from September. And then not long after this one came, I got my October box, which was the fantasy floral one. Um, and this one was so big that it like busted the box. <laughs> so we'll take all of this stuff out and I'm really excited about this one. This is going to be fun for February. I think a lot of people are trying to like stay away from the Christmas stuff and stuff like that just because everyone has all of their Christmas stuff and people are very particular about their holidays and all that good, th good stuff. So stuff, stuff, stuff. Anyways, let's go through this. So in this one, we get a felt charm and planner clip, which is very generous, um, but they're both like that hot pink. So this is the planner bow or planner clip, and it has like a rose gold um, paper clip. And then we have the planner charm here, which has the little hook. And then we have the five washi tapes, which again in a pouch. I really love how she's been giving the pouch. It reminds me of like an Ipsy bag. <laughs> um, but then we have, we only have one of the big washies this time around. And it has the rose gold bows on the background of the black and floral pattern there. And then the rest are her small um, 10 millimeter washies, I believe. So this one is just a striped pattern with like the fuchsia and rose gold and white. Um, and then we have the smaller bows of the big bow. So it's the same floral background with the tiny bows. And then we have this lace on the fuchsia or hot pink color. And then this one, which is really pretty, is her script, which it says, go get it, live boldly, um, stay, dream bigger. And it has little floral clip art in between each of those sayings. So I think that's really pretty. And then we have, oh, this was awesome. She like gave a cuff, a rose gold cuff in all of them. And she said that this, like the price of this was the price of the whole box. So I think that's really pretty. And then you get this really nice like um, felt bag to kind of keep it in. So I'm definitely gonna keep that. Um, but it's like a little cuff with all like the bows on it. It's so pretty, and I think it'll fit my wrist, my tiny baby wrist, or maybe not. Oh, yes, it does. Um, I mean, it's so big, but, like, if it was any smaller, I probably couldn't get it on. But look how pretty that is. I think it's so pretty. Um, so, yeah, there's that. It kind of pinches you when you take it off, but I'm fine with it. Beauty is pain. So, <laughs> there's that. And then um, there's the pouch here, which is floral. This would be really pretty for makeup. Um, but I might put bows, or not bows, um, might put um, planner clips in this as well. And then we have the glitter pen here, um, which is like super glittery. Um, and it is a like clicker pen. Um, and yeah, it's kind of like the textured glitter, which is nice. And then the clip here says simply gilded. Um, and then we have the foiled sticker seals and they're all that really pretty floral pattern. This would be really cute to seal your valentines with. Ooh, that's an idea. I'm gonna save those for that. <laughs> um, and then we have the um, TN insert, which if I could open this, please. Some of them are really hard to open. Some of them aren't. And I never want to like cut the cut the insert, but I don't really know. Never cut towards yourself. <laughs> okay, so there's this. And it's rose gold foiled as well with like the little bow across the bottom and then the dream boldly on the back. And it's just plain. Ooh, that's pretty. The stitching is pink. That's fun. Okay, there's that. And then the foiled journaling card here, which also says live boldly. And then the Lux sticker sheet, which appears to be the same 
as the last one, like the formatting of it. So there's that. Oh, the full boxes are really pretty. That's going to definitely be a Valentine's Day kit that I use in my Kiki K. This could also be a very fun, like, summer or spring kit, I think. Um, and then we have this big heart foiled sticky note there, which I love it. So I'm going to go ahead and just, like, I don't think I can put everything out, but I'm just going to put as much out as I possibly can. Um so that I can, you know, show you guys everything that we just went through. Um, but yeah, it's kind of funny because some of this stuff I ordered a while back. Some of it I ordered more recently and it just came. Like, Scribble Prince Co. has been on top of her orders. Like, she's been getting stuff out left and right. Um, like, just the Wiggle It Wednesdays, those ship... I feel like instantaneously, like I placed my order and um, it was on the way to me. So that's really nice if you're someone who's very impatient. I would say even though like you have to pay more for some of her like stuff, definitely more than other places. But I feel like now too, since she's like expanded her um, kits to include more and like didn't raise the price, you get a ton of stuff. Um, so yeah. I highly recommend her shop and she has a lot of different options for kits like she has her mini kits and like she also has um all of the like monthly stuff that you could possibly want I think this is as much as I can fit in the frame and there's even like this stack of other stickers and freebies and stuff like that but I hope you guys enjoyed um if there's another clip at the end of this video. It's just because I got some orders on Monday. So if the video is not over right now, definitely watch on. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.